Hello, I'm Nestor Beltran from SIP Colombia. In this short video, I will show you the basic concepts of data cleaning based on the principles and methods published by Arthur Chapman. Let's start with the definition. What is data cleaning? We can define it as a process used to improve the quality through correction of detected errors and omissions. This process may include format checks, completeness checks, and limit checks, identification of outliers, among others. The structure that supports the process can be summarized in five key points, all of them related to errors. Define and determine types, search and identify instances, perform the corrections, documentation, and at the end, modify data entry procedures. It's clear that there is a need for data cleaning. Errors are common and expected. So our goal is to improve the quality of the data to make them fit for use. Let's continue with the principles that guide the whole process. The idea with these principles is that you reflect on this when designing your own data quality workflow. Planning. A strategy to implement data cleaning and validation in the organization's culture will improve the overall data quality and also their organization's reputation. Organizing. Organizing data prior to checking, validation and correction can improve efficiency and reduce the time and cost of the cleaning. Prevention. It is far cheaper and more efficient to prevent an error than to have to find it and correct it later. Responsibility. Responsibility for data cleaning is shared and belongs to all. Partnership. If data custodians can develop partnerships with the key users, then the users are likely to provide feedback on errors that they come across when using the data. Prioritization helps to reduce cost and improves efficiency. It is better to concentrate on those records which can be cleaned and at the lowest cost, or for which there is a high demand from the users, for example. Performance measures may include statistical checks on the data, on the level of quality control and incompleteness. Optimization may include avoiding duplication as a major factor with data cleaning in most organizations. Feedback. Users of the data will inevitably carry out error detection, and it is important that they feedback the results to the custodians. Training. Lack of training, especially at the data collection and data entry stages, is the cause of a large proportion of the errors in primary species data. Transparency. Data cleaning processes need to be transparent and well documented, with a good audit trail to reduce duplication and to ensure that once correct, errors never reoccur. Documentation. Documentation is the last one but the key to good data quality. Without good documentation, it is difficult for users to determine the fitness for use of the data and difficult for the custodians to know what, I by, by whom, data quality checks have been carried out. Well, thanks a lot for your attention. We will continue with the exercise proposed for this activity. See you in the next video. Bye.